What's up guys, today I'm going to be doing my 20 subscriber special, and as it is my 20 subscriber special, I thought it would be fitting to rate the numbers 0 through 20. So we're just going to go down this list, and I'm going to give you my rating for each of these numbers. We're starting out with 0, I'm going to have to give 0 a solid B. Now I know what you might be thinking, oh, but, but zero, 0 sucks, zero is, 0 is nothing, zero, 0 is the worst number. And that's not true because you know why zero is a B and not a D or an F? It's because it makes every math problem a thousand times easier. You have a zero in the math problem, boom. That math problem automatically equals zero. Next we're moving on to ten. Ten I don't know, ten is ten could I for most people would probably put ten up in S or A, but I'm gonna have to put it down in a C because personally I just think ten's kinda overrated. It's kind of the standard for everything, you know. You'd you know, you rate stuff out of 10, even percents, or a multiple of 10. 10 is like where the double digits start, you know, but like, there's just really nothing. I feel like there's not that much special about the number 10, so yeah. 11. I'm going to put 11 one above 10 because I just feel like 11 is kind of like 10, but a little more cool because it has the double, you know, the two ones, which is just a little bit cooler than a 1 and a 0. And also... It just, I don't know, it just looks cool. 12. Yeah, 12 is probably just, I'm going to have to put that in D. Not really much to say about 12, really. 13, actually, you know what? 13, I'm going to put 13 in a, I'm going to put 13 in B tier. Uh, You know, 13 is just, you know, it's where the teens start. That's where you get, leave behind the baby names and you move on to the big boy names. 13, 14, 15, you know? So I'm going to have to put it in a solid B up there with 11 and 0. 14. Um. I mean, normally I put it down here in F or D, but I'm going to put it in C for reasons you'll probably realize later in the video. 15. Mm. Again, 15 doesn't have much going for it, but it does have the fact that it's a multiple of 5, which are nice numbers. And it's also a big part of the time unit. Like we met, we tend to measure time in fifteens. If you ever thought about that, you know, quarter past six, half past six, quarter before seven, blah blah. So I'm gonna have to put that in C with fourteen, sixteen. I'll put that in C as well because there's this really uh, famous game. You might have heard of it. It's called Minecraft, and everything is counted by sixteens. 17 garbage no one likes 17 I don't that that goes without saying 18 hmm. I would put it down here in F with 17 but as seeing that 18 is when you officially become an adult I guess I have to put it in D I don't really want to but I guess I have to give it some credit it's not as bad as 17 19 hmm I don't know how I feel about 19 to be honest, I guess I'll just, I'll put 19 in C. There's not really much to be said about 19. One, I'm not going to lie, one's got to be a solid A for me. Again, one makes every math problem ten times easier. It's not quite S, though. 20. I'm going to be honest with you, 20 doesn't have much going for it. I mean, it's, it's just ten twice. You know? I mean, there's not even, like, there's not even that anything that big about 20 except that it starts the normalcy of having the two word names like 21 22 31 32 so on and so forth I don't know man I guess I guess I'm gonna have to put it in D actually because I mean it's not as it's not really as good as 10 2 oh that's a tough one I kind of want to put want to put two in S, but ah, uh, two is gonna go in S, and here's why. Just kidding, I don't really need to explain it, but uh, hey, if you ever thought about it, everything in nature is related, somehow related to the number two. We got the sun and the moon. Uh, it takes uh, uh, two uh, yeah, uh, everything in nature is balanced out by something there's two corresponding it's you know it's like it's kind of like it's like three it's symmetrical but 
there's only two people, two things to look at, not, you know, not a mess, like, more than two, after you get past two, it just becomes a, it just becomes a mess, but two, everything is nice and pristine, there's just two, it's symmetrical, there's just two things to look at, three, I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm feeling a C for three, I don't really, I'm not really feeling three very much, only thing three's got going for it is that's, I mean, how we place things, you know, top three, which, now that I think about it, really is kind of weird how we, like, put everything, you know, we'd say, like, oh, top three, this is the top three out of this, or the top three out of that, when, I mean, why not top two, why not top four or five, like, that, this doesn't really make sense to me. Five? I'm gonna put five up in the B, just because five is just a nice number. It's, it's not too, uh, it's not too much, but it's not too little, and it also... It just every it just it's so satisfying when everything it just is in a multiple of five you know six yeah I'm feeling F for six <laughs> six is not a not a not a very good number seven I'll put seven in B just because seven is seven's underrated man like people don't realize how important seven is dude there's seven days in a week I mean seven looks cool too got 711 I mean hey look 711 same same tier seven's a seven's a pretty good number it's very underrated <clears throat> more people should appreciate seven eight hmm not really sure how I'm feeling about eight to be honest it's definitely not a B in fact I think eight's probably like a D if I'm being honest with you I mean I just can't really think of anything eight that's important or good you know it's just I don't know I'm just gonna put 8 in D to be honest 9 it's not really anything special about 9 uh, you know like I just I just don't really know there's not really much special about 9 it's really just I don't know man 9 just is kinda it's kinda generic you know it's just I don't really know. There's not really much that's cool about 9. Yeah, I'm just going to have to put 9 in the C tier because it's not quite as bad as these numbers down here, but it's also, it's not, it doesn't, not really special. There's nothing special about it. And then 4 is obviously S tier. Uh, there's not really any, we don't need to discuss that. It's obviously, it's pretty obvious that 4 is S tier. In fact, I think I'm going to move 2 down to A tier just so 4 can be an S tier by itself. So yeah, there you have it. That's my number tier list.